joined now by Casey Waugh of Wayside Waves, and she has a <laughs> special guest. This is Murphy. This is Murphy. Tell he, us about Murphy. Murphy is a two and a half year old shepherd mix. Sweet guy. Yeah. He's a little curious this morning, checking out the whole studio. He loves people. Again, like I said, he's curious, but he, little, um, you know, not yeah. sure what's going on, but he's so sweet and so he kind. Is. He actually came to the shelter earlier this year and was adopted for about six months. Return to no fault of his own, just some changes on the adopter's end, yeah. but we're looking for his home. And I was just saying, yeah. he has a team of lovers out at Wayside. Yeah. He loves his people so much. He has so much fun going on walks, being your friend, hanging out. He's great in the car. So if you just want a best friend and a buddy to chill with, spend your days with, He's really your guy. He's a people lover for sure. He's kind of whining, very cute. He is. <laughs> he, he, I think he likes attention. I yeah. think he likes those people. Come say hi, Murphy. Yeah. Um, <laughs> how are you guys doing over there? We are doing really, really well. Thankfully, Kansas City is an amazing place, loves the animals, yeah. wants to find the homes, and they help us out in every way. But we have a lot of homeless animals, dogs, cats, everything. So if you go to waysidewaves.org, you can see all of those animals at any time. Check them out. Come meet them in person. That's one thing I do want to mention. Murphy is not on our adoption floor. Hmm. So when you come out this morning, we open at 10 a.m., just ask to meet him in person, and we will go get him for you and bring him over, and I'm sure he will give you some attention. So you guys, I think <laughs> you mentioned, you guys are max capacity? We we are pretty full of our yeah. Yes, definitely. And like I said, I mean, there are homeless animals all over the yeah. country yep. and here, and, you know, He's from local. We've helped some animals from farther away earlier this week, and we really just want to help all those. And thankfully to the donors and the supporters here in Kansas City, we're able to do all of that. And so how can people, if, if they their living situation doesn't fit for an animal or an animal of this yes. size, like how, how do people help? <laughs> Definitely. There are several ways you can get involved. Always going to waysidewaves.org is a great way to check it out. But you can become a volunteer. You can work with dogs, cats multiple other ways you can be a donor whether that's monetarily or in kind if you have spare blankets or toys or something like that so again various ways just check out waysidewaves.org and you can see all about them and people can volunteer yes volunteering is a big thing and we're really in need of volunteers right now especially with our dogs yeah. and it's fun because you get to go out there and you build this relationship and yeah. you get to see their journeys and you get to see them come in sometimes having a rough past not sure yeah. where exactly they've come from but Man. you see them open up and grow and learn to trust humans and it's because of you mm -hmm. you're making this huge change so it's it's fun to see that and to move uh, through their journey with them well murphy what do you think anything else <laughs> What I miss, Murph? Oh, I He's love He's just going to go all around your legs and trip you. I know, I know. Wayside Waves, you can find everything on their website. Thank you so much.